Hi guys and welcome to another summer vlog slash shopping video. I'm trying to find the river. It's just down there, but I don't know how to get there. <laughs> and we're actually here for the Action Film Festival. I hope you have a lovely summer or if you're living in the southern hemisphere a lovely winter here is definitely a heat wave happening we have over 33 34 degrees practically every day so it's getting more and more difficult to look elegant there's like one fra phrase that says that heat waves are the quickest way to non-elegance because it's very difficult to look nice when it's like 35 degrees but it doesn't mean we are not trying right during early summer I was pretty busy. I was going to many different places around Slovenia for work, for some events I was reporting from film festivals or I actually had a live TV morning show from that location. So the next couple of videos I'm going to take you to different locations and of course explain what I was doing there, show you what I was wearing and you know all the fun we're going to have together. And today I'm going to take you to Kran. Kran is about half an hour, 20 minute drive from the capital Ljubljana. And even though I've been there before, I never actually stayed in Kran to have proper time to explore it. So that was first for me as well. So a lot of places that I'm going to take you are first for me as well. I've never seen that before. And there's actually a very fun part of the video you're going to see. We're going to be looking for river because apparently the river is missing. So I'll explain <laughs> in the next few minutes what's happening there. But that was definitely fun. And also I'm going to show you something that's really unexpected and very unique for the center of this city. And I'm pretty sure you're going to enjoy that as well. And after the vlog, I'm going to show you some of the must-have jewelry pieces that I uh, bought in the last week. And hint, hint, uh, some of them I'm already wearing. As for my outfit right now, I'm wearing a Volvo dress that I bought years ago and it still works like a charm. I'm going to link it below and it's a classic. You can always get it in Volvo and you can wear it in different ways. So you can have it all the way down to your ankle so you can make it short depending on the occasion and of course the temperature. And I love this chocolatey brown color and I don't think I'm going to get another one because for me this one works. This is a dress that I can definitely recommend. I have been wearing this dress for probably like five or six years now and it's still stretchy, it still fits like a glove. So Wolford, well done. All right, so let's go to Kran. <music> morning so we are in Kran right now so I have been doing a lot of kilometers across Slovenia this week it's been interesting uh, traffic is a bit as usual but the city is pretty empty right now because it's quite early it's before 8 a.m. on a Saturday and we are actually here for the Axing Film Festival I'm gonna show you a bit of the city later but this is the view I have right now I'm in front of my hotel and um, I'm actually wearing Cezanne skirt and Zara top I'm gonna show you the outfit if I can. This is actually a really cool town, so I'll be taking you along to a few of the things that we will be doing today. So let's go and have fun. It's been such a crazy day. My hotel room is a mess because I just run in, change and run back out because the weather changes every 10 minutes. So I have to dress like an onion, not to freeze or not to be too hot. You can see in the background <laughs> my, uh, my unpacking and I'm running out again. It is quite cold. So I actually took like two jumpers and short sleeve shirt and long white trousers. Cezanne bucket bag and leather flats because we are actually walking in the old town center so heels are not an option. <laughs> Hi guys, 
it's day three in Kran. I'm trying to find the river. It's just down there, but I don't know how to get there. <laughs> but finally, it's a um, more summer day. It's actually gonna be like 24 degrees. So I have more of a summer outfit on today. Uh, I'll show you in my room what I'm wearing because it's kind of difficult to film here to show you the whole outfit but um let's go and see where we can come out because i can see something down there but i just don't know how to get there and it's my three hours off and i want to explore as much as i can so let's go um i'm not sure if this is the place where the river should be but it's not <laughs> This is a very bright green shirt. It doesn't look very bright here because the lighting is crap. I have Suzanne belt and matching uh, flats, uh, the squared jeans, and of course, Suzanne backer. This is the only bag I actually took for these three days here. And then I have Versace sunglasses and as usual, Misoma jewelry. <laughs> We are actually under the bridge right now and I'm really melting into this surroundings with this green shirt but I'm gonna take it down to the river now and this is the part of Kran I've never been before so it's as new to me as it is to you and I'm really excited to see what's actually down there this is so beautiful there's a little footpath bridge across on the other side and Riverbank, I love it here. Wow, I love the views here. Look, <laughs> there's a bridge up there. Oh, I love this place. Okay, now let's go and find some coffee shop and enjoy some caffeine. So there's another path just in front of me that actually goes down towards the river, but we're not gonna go there because I have to actually go and work now. But let's just enjoy the view for a few more seconds. Look at the birds. Definitely a place to come and just relax and it's right in the center which I'm really surprised and the greenery here and the river is just so relaxing and now it's like midday on Sunday which I would assume is the busiest and there's like maybe 10 people here so definitely a cool place. After lunch, I was back home and 
back to another line of my work and I was in Kran for three days I met a lot of lovely actors and you know casting directors from all over Europe and it was such a lovely time that we spent together and I'm really glad that I met you and I will be keeping my eyes on your careers what's happening there okay now for the jewelry part now if you are new to my channel first of all of course welcome I hope you will stick around if you are not new of course welcome back and you will know when I say jewelry there's like 99% chance that I'm going to be talking about one specific brand and that brand is Misoma I have been buying the jewelry for like four or five years now and I, I think half of my collection is actually Misoma I just love their pieces so much and this is never a sponsored video I wish it was I wish they would give me at least like a pair of Huggies or something but this is not the point why I'm doing this video I wanted to emphasize that I really do love their jewelry and their customer service is amazing and there are certain pieces that I still have on my wish list so there will definitely be more Misoma pieces in the future but today I'm going to show you two pairs of earrings and one ring. The first earrings you could already see from the beginning. These are long drop earrings. You actually have this in different sizes. You have shorter ones as well and like really tiny ones but I wanted these really long ones to kind of emphasize whenever I have a dress like this because I think this on its own works magic. It depends on the occasion of course if it's like really glam I will add necklaces to this but I actually prefer the look of just this dangly earrings and nothing else on the neck and you know just a pair of bracelets and that's it and this is just my kind of like way how I would like to pair this the jewel in there is so sparkly it's unbelievable I mean if you turn your head and it cuts the light it's just amazing they are very light I can't even tell I'm wearing them and that's the information that I always find really important with earrings I don't like heavy earrings I don't like my lobes being stretched or the feeling that something is actually dragging my ears down because the earrings are so heavy so these ones are light as a feather I promise you it doesn't matter what kind of lobes you have you will not feel this that's for sure they're very light and they just look wow I really really love this I don't care for like shorter sizes for me the only option was the long one so this was the first pair I got then I fell in love with this one specific ring and the reason I fell in love with it is because it's a classic it's something you will wear forever it goes with everything you can you know wear it with jeans and t-shirt and you can wear it when you're all glammed up I loved it so much that <laughs> that I actually got to. The point was that I actually was lucky that this ring was on sale so I got two for the price of one and I took two different sizes and I usually wear them together like this but I will wear it occasionally on different hands as well or even just wearing one on any kind of finger you prefer. It's a bit tricky to figure out the size with rings with Misoma because I have miscalculated more than once going by their instructions like measuring and everything and the ring was still too big I mean Misoma has of course return policy so you can return it and you know get a smaller one but it can be a hassle because their sales are never lasting long and if you get something on sale and then it's not just like automatic exchange you have to return it and then buy, buy a new one and by the time you buy the second one the sale might, might be over and it's just it's a hassle so I prefer if I can to order two different sizes and then just send back whichever doesn't fit me but in this particular case I actually knew I wanted to keep both of them I knew I wanted to wear both of them together so it was never an option of sending one bag but with rings it's a bit tricky so I don't have that many rings from Misoma I mostly have necklaces earrings and a few bracelets as well one of them is actually this claw bracelet this one I had for about three years now and even though it still looks pretty cool you can see now at the edge I think you can I'm gonna try to show you the edges are a bit rubbed I mean it's not like silver but the gold plating is starting to come off a bit I mean after three years of pretty much constant wear I don't complain this is still good quality I still stand by that statement for now the quality is still amazing the other bracelets are just some knickknacks that I bought from the stands in London so they're not I cannot link them below but this bracelet is Misoma the last piece of earrings which were the ones that it took me a while to get them because I was never sure 
if they're gonna fit me I was afraid they're gonna be too heavy I was afraid they're gonna be too specific and they will not go with anything apart from maybe like one dress and because the price tag was pretty hefty I didn't want to gamble I didn't want to buy something that expensive and not validate it to myself that I will actually wear it a lot okay I prepared my lobes for the next pair these are Harry's Reed Serpent Mismatched Earrings. I fell in love with this the second they dropped. I think they are just the most amazing, amazing design and they just look so rock and you know me, if it's rock I'm there. I was also afraid that they're going to be too heavy. And truth be told, the snake, it is definitely on the heavy side, but it's not all so heavy that you couldn't wear it, that it would really stretch your lobe. So I can definitely feel the snake earring. This one, the other one is very light, so this one you don't feel as much. It's not, again, it's not so heavy that you would feel uncomfortable, but I can definitely feel that it is kind of pulling on my lobe a bit, but, you know, not too much. And because they are just so special i can let it go that this one is a bit heavy but can you imagine just this and like a leather dress it's like so me right <laughs> i just i love them and i think this pair is something very special and i tried them on with different outfits and i was surprised that i actually do go with a lot more outfits that than i thought initially look at even now i only have like brown fabric dress and even with this, they go, they look nice. I mean, I would change like bracelets and rings and stuff, but you know, this actually works. The important question now is, because I got them on summer, on Misoma summer sale, if I would bought them full price, would I still love them? Yes, I would. I would definitely pay full price for this as well. Now that I've seen them, now that I wear them for a couple of times, yes. I think they're going to be one of my favorite summer earrings for sure. So I think we are ready to face the heat again. As for the summer smells, I don't usually wear perfumes during the summer because when it's a heat wave and you're wearing perfume, this is just like no. But I would use like um, shower gel and body lotion of the fragrance that I usually use like uh, Versace Eros Parfum and I would not apply perfume on top of that when it's too hot. But I actually found a little Cezanne scent that it's not actual it's not like perfume it's just like gentle very gentle smell that actually works even for heat waves so I'm gonna link this perfume down below and I don't I mean the smell is very fresh and light which is not usually my scent I like my scents to be more rock more like fresh still but more on the heavy side and this one is very gentle but it works for the summer when it's too hot to wear actual perfume this for me it works I mean I have been using it for a while now you can see the bottle is getting lower and lower and I would never consider buying a perfume from Cezanne but I bought like a lot of things in the last month this is not because I'm doing YouTube it's just because I bought a huge order and you know they just sent me this with it and I was surprised so I'm definitely when I'm gonna use this up I'm gonna definitely buy something because I think it's the perfect scent when it's too hot to actually wear perfume guys thank you for watching have a great day and great summer great winter wherever in the world you are and of course let me know which is your favorite misoma piece and if you would wear these earrings because i know they are not for everyone but i love them so have a fun day guys and i will see you in the next video